Hello, Cancer. How are you? Hope you're doing well, Cancer. Cancer, if you're a returning soul, welcome back. And if not, welcome to my channel. All right. Pisces Spirit Moon. Let's see what we have for you, Cancer. Cancer, as usual, keep in mind that my readings are timeless and they're general. Okay, so just keep what makes sense, keep what make what resonates, and leave the rest behind. Leave the rest for someone else. Just the way I just clean my, my, my tabletop. Okay? Cancer, if you like how I read and you'd like to book a personal reading with me. Or if you'd like to support my channel and uh, make a kind donation, all of that info is in the description box down below, okay? Also, please click the like button, subscribe, leave a comment, even a hello. That would be nice. All of that helps my channel grow, okay? All right, Cancer, the heart of the matter or what this reading is about. Ace of Wands, a new passionate beginning. What's crossing you, challenging you? Three of Hearts. I think we've got to heal something. Crowning you or in your conscious level and what you do see clearly is the hanged man some Piscean energy right there you're getting some downloads maybe we'll see I don't think you you're we'll get I won't put my shoe in the mouth let me finish and then I'll channel the whole energy below you or Subconscious, what you don't see clearly. It's the King of Pentacles. Strong Taurus energy right there. Behind you or recent past, Knight of Cups. In front of you or where you're headed to or what's coming towards you is the Page of Pentacles. The way you see yourself or how you're responding to this situation. Page of Cups. The energy around you or what's influencing you. The Two of Wands. Okay. Definitely a new passionate beginning hopes and fears six of wands and uh, I kind of kind of wanted to do that like in a I don't I never read reversals but that kind of like showed me that reversed you know I think you're really fearing to not having success okay somehow I get that really strong you're hoping to have success in this situation or when you move out of this energy outcome or advice which is usually for me it's always or I try to always take it as advice it's the full okay it's taking that new leap of faith, that new beginning. And 
I think you have a green light for this bottom of the deck. Beautiful. Five of Swords. It's walking away from the drama, the conflict, the fighting. This could be even inside of you. But it could also be regarding with someone or in a relationship. It could be love uh, with anyone or anything. Take it as a resonance, okay? Then we have the High Priestess. You're listening to your intuition. You're listening to your intuition. That's good, Cancer. Very good. Cancer, it's just right off the bat, it's clear, okay? You're getting messages, you're getting downloads. You feel stuck, you think you're stuck, okay? But you're not. You, you're. It's only in your mind. But the divine is trying to get in touch with you, okay? So there's still something that we gotta work on, okay? Because you're upside down. He's being illuminated, but uh, I think you feel stuck, but this is the universe saying, I, uh, I need you to see things in a different way and from another point of view. That's why uh, that's why I have you in this position for now. Okay. In your recent past, we have the Knight of Cups. Uh, you're ready to take uh, to take that cup to to fulfill yourself emotionally somewhere else, and I think you have already gone through something here where you have been somehow upgraded emotionally, okay? But I think you're in search of a new adventure, something fulfilling. That's why we have that Ace of Wands, is that new passionate beginning. It's a fresh start. You're headed off to this energy. Small. Maybe if it could be an investment of any type, um, you feel you don't have enough to start or you might see yourself as a beginner. But it's okay. It's good. Everything starts small. I think for some of you, you are already healing this. There has been some type of heartbreak or betrayal. That's why you're walking away now. That's why we have that five of swords. You've had enough of something. Okay. If you haven't healed this, you have to do it, okay? I wish I could tell you how, but that's not my job, you know? Everybody heals in different ways. But starting something passionate, something new, always helps a lot. Because that helps us put our mind in different things. Change of perspective. Okay. What you don't see clearly, deep in your subconscious, and maybe what the divine is trying to really show you, is that you're not really this, you are that. Okay, but it's, it's sometimes the way we see ourselves, you see? You see yourself as that, another page, okay? Take that out of your mind. And this is why 
you have to work in this. Once you heal that sense of betrayal or broken heart, pain, you're no longer going to be seeing yourself like this. Okay? So don't ignore your emotions. That's what that card is telling you very strongly. Okay? Because he's stepping on his, on his cape. And that cape is blue and it kind of almost like It's kind of like connecting with the ocean behind him. It's somehow like saying you're stepping on your emotions, kind of like kicking. You know how I, I cleaned my table when I started reading, pushing it away? I think you're doing that. Don't do that. Okay, heal your emotions. When you heal, you won't be, you won't see yourself that way. This is who you really are, but you're not seeing it clearly. Okay. The energy around you is a tool of wands. You do have that sense of having the world in your hands. The world is your oyster. It's a white vision, a new project. Just for some of you, this could be wanting to start something on the web because we have the world in there. World Wide Web, you know, could be working from home or a side project or oh, even a YouTube channel like I started, something. But there's some planning here, there's some expansion. But you are even if it's knowledge or whatever you feel that you, you don't have enough, you can do it. Even if you have to start small, you have to do the best with what you have. It's like me, take my example. I have this new channel, you know, I don't have the best camera. I'm using an old mobile phone. This is my phone, but the one that I'm using is a really outdated phone. <laughs> But it's got, a, it's got a good camera resolution in it, you know. And uh, that's, I don't have high quality lamps. Uh, but someday I know that if my channel grows, you know, it will progressively pick up and, and it will start. But what am I doing? I'm doing the best with what I have, you know. That's what you have to do. Okay, that's good. Your hopes and fears is wanting that victory. You're going to have it because the ace of, of, of wands, that's divine. That's coming from the divine to you. It's a green light. They're just literally telling you, go for it. Go for it. Don't be afraid. Don't let that hold you back. You're good enough. Stop seeing yourself like a page. Okay? And still, anyway, you know, if you're starting something new, you always start small. Okay? The advice. This is the universe telling you, go for it. Take that jump, take that leap of faith. I'm with you. You see that dog? That's the universe with you. Or it could be even a guide, someone who has passed. They're just strongly telling you, don't be afraid, take that leap of faith. Go for it. They're protecting you. Yeah, you have to, or you have already done that. You've you've walked away from from that fighting. It could be even a mental struggle within you. Okay, 
Sometimes we, we hurt ourselves. But you're walking away from me. Listen to your intuition. That's a high priestess. Also very strong Piscean energy. I get there. That's a lot of water. You're a water sign. Stand your ground. Keep fighting. Okay, don't give up. That's my pre empress. I think you will be abundant in many ways if you take that leap of faith. Okay. All right, Cancer. What can I say? Very nice reading. It was quite quick, actually. Quicker than usual. But I think it's what you needed to hear. That's what I try to do. Okay, I try to deliver the message that people need to hear. Sometimes people need that little extra kick of confidence. They need to hear it from someone else because we can get lost in our own thoughts, confused. We're not sure if we're good enough for something. But you are. You are. The Divine is with you, Cancer. So whatever it is that, that you really want to do in this situation, don't be afraid. Go for it. Okay. All right, Cancer. Well, I'm going to leave it there for you. Okay. I hope the reading helps you. I hope it 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 it, it really uh, gives you that confidence for your project or your ideas. Okay. And I wish you all the best luck. You will be successful. That's for sure, because you're protected. All right, Cancer, I'll let you go now. All right. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking around. Okay. And I hope to see you next time. And as usual, Cancer, stay safe, stay happy, and stay very blessed. Because you are. You're being guided. All right. All right. Goodbye, Cancer. <laughs>